Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing really well. Today I will be sharing with you guys one of my apple cider vinegar recipe. A lot of you guys have asked me how I put together my apple cider vinegar beverage and so I thought I'd make this video for you guys so that you can make this at home on your own. So the first thing that you'll need is of course the apple cider vinegar and this is the Bragg's apple cider vinegar. It is the raw unfiltered apple cider vinegar uh, with the mother and please Please make sure that you purchase the one with the mother because that's the one uh, that has most of the nutrients in there and that's what you'll need. Um, and this is a fresh new bottle. I have been going through apple cider vinegar a whole ton this summer. I've been making this drink a lot this summer. I've, make, I've been making different variations of this drink. I've been adding different types of ingredients and just playing around with other types of fruit juices as well. So I mean feel free to put any ingredients that you feel would be refreshing to you or would be appetizing to you. Okay, and the next thing that you'll need is of course water and some cinnamon. And if you like to have your um, beverage sweet, then obviously I would recommend a sweetener. I would recommend um, the maple syrup. It has to be the pure maple syrup or a sweetener that is called stevia. And stevia is great because it is a natural sweetener. And this one here is a organic vanilla cream flavor. And I really, really love this as a sweetener. It's uh, really actually convenient because it comes in a tincture, a tincture bottle. And the last thing you'll need is a mug or a jug full of ice. This is a quart size um, jug and I've just filled it with ice. And also you'll need a tablespoon. I don't usually use a tablespoon, but um, for the sake of the video, I figured I would measure things out for you guys. So we will start with uh, pouring the water into your glass. And again, you don't have to use ice. I just prefer ice because I like um, my bever uh, beverages pretty icy in the summertime. So we're just gonna pour it in. I'll just pour it in halfway. And then what I actually like to do is put in the cinnamon first and then fill uh, the rest of the mug up with um, water. Now I like a lot of cinnamon, so it really depends on how much cinnamon you want to use. I love a lot of cinnamon and there's just endless um, health benefits to cinnamon. And I purchased this big honking thing at Costco and I've been loving Costco as of late. I've been loving going there to purchase almost everything. <laughs> Also, one other thing I wanted to mention to you guys about cinnamon is that it is very high in antioxidants. It also is an anti-inflammatory. It also helps regulate blood sugar levels and it has many beneficial effects on neurodegenerative disease. So it is great for that brain of yours. So anytime you have a chance to incorporate cinnamon into your diet, I highly recommend that you do so. All right, so once the cinnamon is in your cup, it's time to put in the apple cider vinegar. So I am going to measure in about two tablespoons. Um, you can put in as much apple cider vinegar as you like. I say two tablespoons is safe. Uh, one tablespoon if you're new to apple cider vinegar and you're not really used to the taste yet because it does have a little bit of a funky taste but you kind of build yourself up to it if you've been drinking apple cider vinegar for a really long time. So I'm going to put in about two tablespoons. So we'll measure it out. So just two tablespoons into your cup. I think I'm gonna do three tablespoons. Just because I usually have a lot and I figured two would be safe, but it doesn't look like it would be enough for me. So you put in two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar into your cup and it should look something like this. All right. And then you can add your sweetener. Um, sometimes I don't use sweetener, um, but today I'll use sweetener. And again, I'm using the stevia. And I usually like to just put in maybe three to four drops of this. Uh, you can use more or less depending on how sweet you like your drink, but I think three to four is a safe number. And once you do that, you just fill your cup in with more water. Also, another thing you can add to this is lemon, and 
Um, when you add the lemon in, it actually tastes like an apple pie. I know it sounds really, really strange, but it seriously does taste like an apple pie with a little bit more um, sweetener or maple syrup. It just tastes so delicious. Okay, and then you're just gonna stir it up and then just sip on this throughout the day. I usually have maybe two to three cups of this. And another ingredient that I really like to put in this is beet juice or a little bit of apple juice. And it just tastes super delicious. Um, the other day I actually put in watermelon juice into this beverage. So I filled it up uh, with water halfway and then I put the apple cider vinegar and cinnamon in and then I filled the rest of it uh, up with watermelon juice. And it was so, so delicious and so refreshing. So I highly recommend you guys try any sort of like cold pressed juice or any of your favorite juices. All right, so I will give this a try. I already know what it tastes like, but I'll just try it for the sake of the video. Oh, and also make sure that you drink it from a straw because the acid in the apple cider vinegar is uh, really strong and you don't want to um, ruin your teeth. So make sure that you always have straws on hand. And yeah, that's pretty much uh, my apple cider vinegar concoction. It's um, super delicious. And please let me know if you decide to make this at home. It is great for your skin. If you're someone who's also looking to lose weight or, you know, if you have indigestion problems, um, Definitely look into uh, incorporating apple cider vinegar into your diet because it does help a lot. In terms of weight loss, please don't expect any like overnight results or anything like that. It is gradual, um, gradual results in terms of weight loss. It just helps you eat a little bit less and it just helps digest things and move things along a little bit easier. So it's not a magic in a bottle or anything like that. So please don't assume that this is going to help you lose weight the next day. But yeah, that is pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was kind of fun to make this video because I never really thought that I would be bringing apple cider vinegar into my bedroom. <laughs> but um, anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please let me know if you make this uh, concoction down below. Please leave comments and subscribe if you haven't already. And please like this video if you like uh, these types of video. And I will see you guys in my next one. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Hi, guys. I'm back. Okay, so I have a little bit of a bonus clip for all of you who stuck to the end of the video. Um, I have actually drank my apple cider vinegar drink a little bit less than halfway. So now what I'm going to do is pour in my favorite juice at the moment. And this is something that I purchased at Costco. And I have been buying heaps and heaps of these. I purchased maybe two to three bottles a week and I've been going through them like a mad woman. Uh, they are the cold pressed juice uh, from the Press Juicery. Uh, it is the beet apple lemon ginger. It's 100% juice. And this is what it looks like. It comes in a 1.5 liter bottle. So if you are at your local Costco, they may even have this for you. And it is actually pretty uh, cheap. It was $7.99 uh, for this whole 1.5 liter bottle. And usually when you go to like one of those cold pressed juice places, you know, those really bougie ones and that where all the hipsters hang out they probably will run you about six or seven dollars um, for the 500 mil anyway so you might as well go to Costco and get the big one okay so what you do is I what I like to do is actually pour um, the rest of it uh, or pour the juice into um, my cup and I just like to fill it all the way up and it kind of just gives you a different variety throughout the day and I love to do this if I'm getting bored of drinking the same flavor. And it kind of makes the color look really, really pretty. So delicious, you guys. This is the stuff that I crave. I know, it's super weird. It's super weird to crave apple cider vinegar, but... Oh, I love making these types of drinks and I love to just have them throughout the day. It's so, so nutritious and it just yields so many health benefits. So if you want any more information on apple cider vinegar, I have made a video down below. Although it is a little bit in sorts because it was one of my starter videos, so I was kind of nervous, but um, 
if the you didn't catch the drift in that video, then please do just Google uh, benefits on apple cider vinegar and cinnamon. There is heaps and heaps of um, information out there for you guys. But yeah, that is pretty much my bonus clip. I hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, I will see you next time. Bye guys.